I see you're still walking and breathing despite the divorce and losing your job. That's what I call growing some balls, Casey. Frankly, I doubted you had those, bro. Hey, chin up! Life is painful. You have to learn to love life or start loving pain. <laughs> Speaking of pain, how's Jody? <laughs> you were a hot couple. Missing married life, huh? Hiding your feelings. Are you crying? Anyhow, we need to finish the divorce. I found a lawyer who can take care of the prenup. I have a meeting with him soon. It seems late for a phone call. Is that Jody? How about I use all my charm to seduce and then horribly dump your ex? Whoa, whoa, I'm just kidding. You are overreacting. Sorry, I guess I had too much to drink last night. Let's get back to what we were talking about. I mean, forget it, come on. You can't see it now, but there's something big ahead, I promise. And as for losing your job, f fuck it. I remember he had a cool idea for his startup, round something? Ah, the one where you can jump into the local rainforest for a spiritual journey with your kindred spirits. Sounds fun. I could probably use something like that. I mean, you kept whining that you had no time or experience to start something. You have plenty of free time now. <laughs> and as for the experience, check Kanya over there. She's a kick-ass nerd from somewhere in Asia. I don't know. She might have some WIPs for you. I've worked with her once. She's the best in the valley to start a business with. Go talk to her. I'll send you everything I know about her. It might help you with negotiation. Talk to Kenya. It's time to make history. You have a fetish for Asian girls or what? So, what did you want? A platform to find tour guides, instructors, and tourists based on level of training, skill, readiness, desire of risk, and other parameters. Hell of a list, but it might be interesting. There's a ton of traveling projects on the market right now. Although, I haven't seen a proper one yet. If we use some of my old groundwork, it might actually work. A startup? With you? Oh.
You know, I was looking for a job anyway. I'll call you, okay? Add me on Friendface. My account is at Kanyasha. Well, bye! Any more booze for your friend? We're not a Mother Teresa shelter here. Yo, good morning. Are you hungover after last night? Why so sad? Oh, I have too much of a hangover to think. And yet, you are working already. <laughs> good job, brother. Good job. Oh, by the way, I have great news for you. Uh, you can start your happy dance right now. I have some friends who helped me get you a spot at tomorrow's Startup Valley Conference. You'll have a chance to pitch your idea to a bunch of rich dudes. Yeah, yeah, don't thank me. Although, I am the one who set it up. I hope you've started on your pitch presentation already, right? Alright, I believe in you, Casey. Your presentation has got to give investors a hard-on. So, you need info, and where do people get it? On the internet. So get to your computer and start surfing. You are welcome. Let me know if you need anything. Fine. Hey, I won't bother you anymore.
Okay, see. How about checking out a bar tonight, huh? We can chat about SVC and discuss your strategy. Uh, if you change your mind, I'll be at Jack's Smoke Bar. <laughs>